hello guys welcome back to my channel i don't know why i'm still in my coat and my jacket because i just got home i didn't really think oh yeah i'm gonna make a video today but hey ho here i am i'm gonna be doing my q a i've asked you guys on my instagram my twitter my snapchat my whatsapp a couple of friends everywhere my social media for you guys to drop me a question for my q a some of the questions are bloody horrendous like why are you guys asking such haram questions as if I'm gonna answer it on my bloody YouTube? Like, I have got fans watching, you know? Please, have the decency to not ask stupid questions like that. My mum watches my videos, so I know mum's been watching this. Just imagine, yeah, my mum watching it. It's the most haramest thing ever, and you want me to answer that on my channel? Unless you want me to get a one-way ticket back to Bangladesh. Carry on answering it. Um, I don't want this to be too long. I had a bunch of questions I just chose out, whichever one's good. First question was under my introduction video. So it's from Joseph Bellegan. He is a, he's lovely. <laughs> I'll put his link down in the description below. So check it out. He asked, what made you start YouTube? Good question, what made me start YouTube? To be honest, do you know what? I wasn't really inspired by anyone. I just wanted to do it like, I like being behind the camera, if you know me, I'm always snapchatting Well actually, I don't really watch YouTubers like that I've watched Zoella and I don't know to be honest I like working on like creative stuff, so like I like making videos, I like making editing, watching I'm very like, I'm, I'm a brave person, like I'm not shy, I will go out on the streets and I will do pranks I will scare people, I will approach people, you give me them days I'll go do it like so I believe I've got that personality to make a YouTube channel and make those videos because without it I don't think like you've got to be a bubbly person you've got to be out there because if you're a quiet person just like no it's not gonna work you're not cut for YouTube if you're like <laughs> if you're a really quiet person and you're not out there you've got to be out there so I thought look I've got the personality I'm out there I'm a friendly person I'm a people's person I like interacting, socialising, I like to get up to no good and do things that aren't really meant to be done like these pranks and whatnot. So I guess I thought yeah let me just start a channel up and so I guess my personality made me want to start a YouTube channel up. Another question, Shaz to style, hairstyle, oh Mohammed from college. When are you going to launch a tutorial? What tutorial please? I didn't say I'm going to launch a tutorial yet. I haven't requested but actually i have a makeup tutorial but if you're asking about a makeup tutorial and you're a boy asking about that it's making a question your likes and gender anise shabik would you rather have free wishes for anything it can't be unlimited wishes or live your whole life happy i think i'd rather have three wishes so one of the wishes could be to live your whole life happy so that way I've got that in the wish then my other wish would be I just want to be successful that's what I want to be I've got a couple of dreams I want to go to uni I want to be driving by next year before summer comes Shumi Uddin what happened to your old stuff okay for those of you who don't know my old subscribers you guys don't know about them um, I used to do old videos like the Bean Boozle challenge I did the overdose prank on my brother where I made him faint because I pretended to overdose <laughs> I've had to take that video down because I probably wanted it done. But I've deleted all those stuff. I mean, I got a good amount of views on them, but the quality of the camera was horrendous. I didn't have a proper camera back then. Now I've invested in one, so do you know what? I thought, let me start again. Keep all professional. I never really did any proper editing back then. Like, it was just iMovie. I did have all the software to use it. Like, I use different softwares now to edit and I know like more better about YouTube than I did before. So now I thought, yeah, okay, start again. What's called Mia? I'm sorry if I say her name wrong, guys. I don't know how to pronounce it. Why is it a crime to have a girlfriend in a Bengali household? I don't think it's a crime in just a Bengali household. It would be in any Asian culture household. I mean, like more Muslims because obviously it's against your religion. But then again, like I know a couple of Pakistani people when they get together with someone else, their parents accept it, they're so like alright right with it. I know a couple of Bengali like friends, their siblings have had like love marriages and stuff. And it depends to be honest, but it's more of a crime because 
hey ho, you're not meant to have a girlfriend or boyfriend relationship. You're not meant to have a girlfriend or boyfriend because, I mean, you're all meant to keep a hello, I guess. I don't know. You should ask your parents why is it a crime to have a girlfriend in the household of a Moody house. Not that that makes sense, but you know what I mean. Um, that French guy, Hafiz. <laughs> How real are you about YouTube? I'm real enough to be doing this video right now and answer your goddamn question. That's how real I am. Bruh. Zara from Instagram asked, What do you study? That was in my first video, so if you haven't checked that out, go check it out now. I'll leave the link up there somewhere. Um, I study media, so within my media course, we look at photography, filming, editing, all that stuff. So I guess that's going to help my YouTube channel. Shaz from Instagram said, Do you remember secondary school days? That's something I don't want to talk about, it's so embarrassing, like we used to, basically me, Shazia and Zemran, we used to like hang around in school together at times and we used to make these videos and it was like the hot or not videos on Facebook, like we like to be in a hot or not video, we used to just muck about, piggyback each other around, fast forward it, can't we just pose in front of the camera, like waste our time around lunch times, those days were horrendous. She remember us, do you love me, miss me? And what's my deepest secret and my first love? Jimmy, well, of course I love you. Of course I miss you. I haven't seen you in ages. The last time I saw you was when we were at that baby scan. AKA your kidney scan or whatever it was. My deepest secret. It wouldn't be a secret if I told you guys. So I think I'll keep that to myself. First love. Do you know who my first love is? Do you guys really want to know who my first love is? It was Justin Bieber. I swear to God, I, till this day, I'm obsessed with Bieber, you don't understand. I'm not overly obsessed, like before, I used to be so crazy about him. FX, FX.01, where are you from? So, country-wise, I'm from Bangladesh. Area-wise, I'm from London. The Jobby. How amazing is Jobby? I don't know what that means, I have to hands. What's my favourite workout and can you cook? Do I ever go to the gym? To have a favourite workout? Maybe I used to, but not anymore. Guess when I used to go to the gym, um... My favourite workout was on the cycles, I guess. Can you cook? Yes, I can cook. I can make like all the basic English food, like pasta, shepherd's pie, um, spaghetti, ugh, spaghetti bolognese, um, egg fried rice, all the simple stuff. Like, I can, I can pretty much cook chicken most, like anything chicken based. But I just, I, I could do meat, but not meat curry. Do you get it? Mac. I don't know why I'm making you call you this. Would you ever go bisexual for your man or side man? Hashtag threesome. I just had to like deep what you actually asked. No, I would not. Yasin, he asked, would you rather have a lesbian daughter or a gay son and why? I God forbid my son or daughter will not turn gay or lesbian. Neither. I don't want a gay son or a lesbian daughter. Do you know how disturbing that is? I'm not homophobic, but I mean, for me to like. But to be honest, because I'm having to answer this question, I think I'd rather have a gay son. Actually, I'd rather have a lesbian daughter because if ever I discover it, and then I know, girls are more easier to put sense into. Taz, what's your favourite makeup brand? Drugstore wise, I guess it would be Sleek or Revolution. So high end would be MAC or NARS. Shumi asked another question on Snapchat this time though. Do you scrunch or fold the tissue when you wash your bum? For real? <laughs> I do both. If I'm feeling artistic, I might already my tissue up and wipe it. MK watching the timeline on Twitter. If you could only drink one drink for the rest of your life, what would it be? I'll drink water for the rest of my life. It's Fahim Yeah from Instagram asks, do you like pizza? Of course, I love pizza. Pizza's the best. Do you know what? I like pineapple on pizza. Some people might feel ill, but it's actually really nice. Matt Allen from Snapchat. Or oh, everyone from Sarah Renault. Can you bring your ride or die? <gasps> Who be your ride or die? You be one of them, of course. Shamsa would be another one of them. To be honest, like, all the people I used to speak to, they've just dispersed somewhere, so... Like a couple of people, yeah, I speak to here and there, but it's not like it was before. 
Okay, this was from Nashiba on Snapchat. This girl has asked like a billion questions. So I picked out a couple of hers. My home name. Nashat. That's my home name. What do I hate about myself and like about myself and what's my best feature? What I hate about myself is I can be really moody at times, I guess. Like, it's not that something's happened. Like, I would generally be moody and it, I will take it out on people, but I wouldn't mean to. But like, I don't know why I do that. And then people come to me like, oh, you're right. You're like about to cry. And that really annoys me. And when someone says you're about to cry, I feel like I just want to cry because now that you've said it, I might as well. Um, what I like about myself. I like that I can approach people, talk to people, not give a crap about people think about me because you know what, it used to affect me before but now I just think, who are you to me for me to be getting so hurt about this, whatever you're saying, this and that. Um, best feature I think, eyes or lips. Two of my cousins actually had asked me, three actually, three of my cousins, Sadia, Sabika and Nazia. Nazia, Nazia. I'm not going to call them off on camera because that's a bit weird. Nazia had asked if you were on desert island and could have one fan member and one friend and one item with you, who and what would it be? One friend that I would take with me is definitely is Shamsa. That's my best friend. She's basically my boyfriend, but the girl. If that makes sense. <laughs> one family member. Okay, that's a hard. Okay, if it had to be a cousin, I would take. Well, I get along with all the cousins, and I'm pretty much close to them. But. I've got to think of it like one of the cousins is good at doctor stuff, one of them is good at like, pharmaceuticals, one of them is good at teaching, one of them is good at architecture. So, to be honest, I would like to take all of you because you guys could all help me in every form and shape. Like, you guys could find ways to build a tent for me or whatever. So, in all words of honesty, I would want to take you all and I can't just choose one of you because I'm loyal to you guys. And um, one item that I would take. My phone. I don't. I can't survive without my phone. Sadia, Sadia. <laughs> How many lives do you have? And my cat to have more than one life. I know I love cats, but I've only got the one life, and I'm still using it right now. Sabika asked, "Who's your favorite cousin?" That's a question you're not meant to ask me because you're just putting me in a spot where I have to choose between two cousins. There's no even between seven of you guys because you're all eliminated except for two of you guys. My favorite cousin would be. Their sisters, so you guys would know who that is. It's either Nazia or Tasha. Actually, wait, but I'm close to all the girl cousins, so it's really hard for me to choose who is my favorite cousin because I want to talk to you guys. You don't, you're not meant to do things like this to me. Do you know what? I'm going to leave that question out of it. I'm never going to answer it because that's just a hard thing to answer. Another question is from Kian on my Instagram. Why no haram questions? Because. Haram questions are haram and halal questions are halal. So we want the halal questions and not the haram questions. Simple as that. Another question is from Is That General. He is another YouTuber and I'm gonna leave his links in the description below. Make sure you guys go check out his channel, subscribe to it, like on his videos, do what you gotta do in it. But he gave me a question asking what or who inspired you to start YouTube and why? I inspired myself to start YouTube because I think I've got the personality for it. Well, Joseph asked a similar question, pretty much the same thing, so do you know what? You two great minds think alike, you know. There will be times where, yeah, I'm not going to be uploading anything onto YouTube because maybe I haven't got anything to upload. Maybe I haven't had the time to film because I've been so busy with life. But you know what? I'm active on social media and I will keep you guys up to date and everything and whatnot. Okay, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Insta, Twitter, add me on Snapchat. Do the lot. And that's it for me today guys, I hope you enjoyed my video and there's lots more videos to come, I promise you, you guys will love them, you guys will enjoy my videos so I'll catch you guys next time.